Uh, Japanese soda that they had at the 7-Eleven. That. Uh, it was like that at $10, though, but it was worth it. That. I get probably like trying depending on what condition it is. Yeah. Yeah. But to fix it, so. Yeah, I can fix it myself. I just get the uh, screen. So they're gonna try to get to try to fix it. I can do it myself. You know what you're doing. Yeah. Better just to pay to get that shit done. Get that shit done right. Right. You know. Sometimes I pay for that shit just out of convenience. Yeah, I, I, you know what I mean? I got the tools at the house. That's just right. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, we got the tools. That's half the battle. Yeah. Yeah. So I was fixing computer size like a uh, kid, like a teenager. Uh, e even yeah, Windows computers. got the tools like that. Man. Yeah. E even, when, even when I was, uh, had Windows computers and fixing up Apple computers, it's, yeah. geez, it's not as hard as it seems. It all depends what you're doing. Damn. What's up? You know what you're doing, boy? Yeah. Y'all got a lot of shit up on there, dog. Then I need to get back on my stock trade. Right. Cause it's easier to do it on there than on the phone. What kind of stock you trade? What you got going on? Yeah. Trying to catch in on these those coins, man. Because they're about to be the next thing for me. Uh, what's going on? What kind of coins you got yeah. going? You want to give up your information, though? Yeah. <laughs> got some good info for a bite. On the real, man. This cryptocurrency is where it's at, man. Like, you now forget what other people are talking about. If they not into it, though. But I highly recommend it though. It's all how you go about it. Cryptocurrency? Yeah. You heard the man, cryptocurrency. I don't know yeah. about the cryptocurrency, but I'm a crip and I got currency, motherfucker. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't on that, nigga. I'm a crip with currency right about now, nigga. Right, yeah. Gotta get the crypto Keep this shit live, fly crippin', man. Uh, I know how we do it. Currency, buy some business stocks. Yeah. Oh, they been booming too. Yeah. Like I said, nigga might think, nigga probably think you crazy until you get rich off that shit. You know what I mean? Niggas be thinking you dreaming until you might get fuck around. I think you gonna fuck around, stumble up and get rich off that shit, bro. You yeah. know? Niggas, you feel me? Niggas don't believe in it till, till they see something. Once that nigga see some results, everybody in their mama gonna be trying to get on some shit then. Exactly. You know what I mean? So, yeah. stick with, you know, whatever you think gonna work for you, gotta do what it do. Exactly. Not do my best to like better test like different options that works out if it works out i recommend it if yeah. it don't work out i wouldn't recommend it you know yeah now you got some big faces on you some working yeah. out nigga. yeah See, that's half the battle. Niggas be talking that big shit, but they ain't got no bread. You know, you talking, you got this high power plan, how to make money, yeah. but you broke. But you asking yeah. me for it's, some it's bread. Like, not, not even just high power, just like something that's like uh, other people, they do that high power shit, you know. 
And group is in your grind. So exactly. You gotta grind. grind. You gotta grind for what you want. No. Look at what I do. Don't judge me by what you hear, nigga. Judge me by what you see, nigga. What you what you see me do every day. Yeah. Feel yeah, me? No. So I gotta know how to leverage that income. Doesn't, doesn't matter what they do in life. They put their mind to it. Yeah, what's up? Stay away from the negative bullshit. Exactly. You do it good, it's always gonna be some negative shit going on. Nigga, niggas is miserable. Yeah. Misery love company. So I right. miserable. I ain't miserable, nigga. I'm happy, nigga. Yeah, that I'm that part. I I'm way, <laughs> Fuck, I gotta be mad at that nigga. Woke up this morning. Exactly. Another day in the hood, on the grind. You know, downtown at the store doing my thing. You know? Now to come down to the hood, tap in. Make sure shit straight. Oh, man, it was crackin' yesterday, man. Oh, yeah, I was down yesterday, yeah, I but I, love, man. I tapped in for a minute, got on, man. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna get some paint. We're gonna paint all this shit, man. Get this shit right, buddy. Ah. Nigga, get too old for this shit, good. Yeah, me too, man. I'm like, get too old, boy. I'll be fences and shit, bro. Top of the top, what up, what up? Top of the top, neighborhood. What's up, I had to come tap in with him. How you been? DVD, shit, this shit, DVD, DVD. I'm there. I'm none today, no. How you been, top of the top? That's the man, hold on, let's get it. Hold on, what you got over there? What you selling over there, man? What you selling over there, man? DVD, 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 where Slauson Bruce at, man? Real ones are still out here. All the other ones on the sideline, nigga, out there on the internet, nigga, nigga, tapping in through the internet. We out here, though. Feel me? We out here. Nigga ain't, ain't at home. On their computers tapping in right here in the field. Right here in the field. No mystery. Nigga ain't hard to find. Nigga like out here on the regular. No big deal. Right here. Slaws in the Crenshaw. Another day on the grind. Brody broke. Nah, he's like, you ready to spit some bars, cuz? You ready to come out of retirement, cuz? Nah, come on, Lou. I know you got it, cuz. Yo, big homie head. I know you got you got it, cuz. Some niggas talk about it, but we live it, nigga. I don't give a fuck what that nigga talking about. Niggas talk about it, but nigga, fuck what you talking about, nigga. We grown. What's up, what's up? Top of the top. Making money ain't gotta stay on a swivel. Gotta stay on a swivel all day, nigga. Yeah. Niggas at home tapping in. Come out here in the field. Slossin' and Crenshaw. What's up, my guy? What city you from, big homie? 
What's up with you? Hey, they they call you Cowboy, don't Yes, sir. What city you from, yeah, buddy? North Carolina. North Carolina. Much love, bro. Yeah. Yes, sir. I got you. I got you. Yes, sir. Nigga get love around the world, nigga. What's your problem? Nigga, what's your problem? Run your lap, I'ma run mine. Run yours, I'ma run mine. You know? It's how you finish the race. It ain't how you started, it's how you finish. Ain't no easy race. I should have been retired, but I'm still in the field. Yes, sir. Too hard finding. You know what I'm smoking on, though. You know what I'm smoking on. What's up, homies? What's top of the top. Where y'all from? Where's Sydney? Let me take a picture with you, bro. Let me take a picture with you. Okay, okay. So, shout out, shout out. You know what it do. North Carolina in the house. North Carolina. North Carolina. Yeah. Can't show their respect. I'm going to take a picture with you, bro. That's the cowboy? Yes, sir. That's the cowboy? Yes, sir. How's it going? That's the cowboy. Ain't no niggas out here with this hat on. Ain't no niggas in LA with this hat on. Hennis in North Carolina. Coming at you, baby Riley. Yes, Durham. Yeah. Nigga get love around the world, nigga. What's your problem? <laughs> What's your problem? I'll take a picture together. I'll take a picture together. I'll hit with my Good man, Cowboy. Good man, Cowboy. Yes, sir. Real recognized, real. Yes, sir. Nice love, buddy. The original Cowboy, Dan Dollar. Slow. Yes, sir. Much mm -hmm. love, bro. bro. Appreciate you, yes, sir. Got some merch over there, too. Y'all want to tap in? Got some for you. All right, right for show. Still on the grind. 25 ain't no breaks. Uh, some Russian cream backwoods. Right, you already know. Already know. Let me get one of these power aids, too, man. And on the grind, Slauson and Crenshaw. How long you been working down here, man? How many years you been in the hood? How many? Long time. Right after Oh, why? Oh, you. You wasn't where the homies had this gas station when the pumps was in the middle. Yeah. All oh, right, right, right for sure. You been around. No, you done seen it all. We used to come shut this parking lot down. Huh? <laughs> shut it down. Good looking out, G. Yes, sir. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you, G. Yes, sir. 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 Let's see what first hand what goes on in the Crenshaw district. 
A lot of niggas out here on the grind, shit. Nigga out here doing something they ain't supposed to be doing. I figured niggas should start rolling up and start beating niggas up. That's what I would do if I felt somebody was disrespecting me or disrespecting something that I was doing. I would roll up and just beat their ass. That's what I do, you know what I mean? So I come down here and see who doing what. Nigga ain't gonna come beat some asses. If certain niggas is feeling some type of way, come down here and whoop some ass, you know. When you see some shit that's out of line, nigga. Do what a nigga gotta do. You feel me? Niggas in violation, that's the rule. Nigga, get your ass beat or whatever, whatever the consequences is. You know what I mean? So, you see niggas out here doing something they ain't supposed to be doing? Shit. Fuck getting on the internet, nigga. Ride down here and be like, nigga, that ain't cool. Roll up. And you say, nigga, this shit ain't cool. Stop doing it. A nigga continue to do something that you tell a nigga to stop doing, then by all means necessary, you do what you gotta do. You know? I'm on the grind. I gotta feed my family. I gotta do what I gotta do. If I'm doing something wrong, I'm doing something out of line, I'm right here, I'm easy to find, I'm approachable. If I'm doing something wrong, tell me, look, bro, you're doing something wrong, I don't like what you're doing. I'm going to respect that, or I'm, gonna, or I'm not going to respect it, and I'm going to continue to do what I do. Feel me? If I'm doing something wrong, come holler at me, say, hey, cowboy, this shit ain't cool. Feel me? Just tell me it ain't cool. Cowboy, you're doing something wrong, that's fine. Whatever, roll up. Feel me? And I'm going to respect that, or I'm not going to respect it. Feel me? So, until a nigga talk about what I'm doing or what I sell in my store, roll up to my store, see what I sell in my store before you say what I got that's real and what's fake and, and whatever it may be. Roll up and check it out. You feel me? And if I got something that ain't supposed to be there, then handle me appropriately. Feel me? Because I know if my shit is in your shit and you're doing some shit, nigga, I'm on my way. Feel me? Ain't gonna be no question. I ain't about to be sending no texts and shit. If I got a problem with a nigga, I'm gonna address it. Feel me? I got time to be expressing myself. I got a problem with you, you're gonna know firsthand. Feel me? So, all this internet jibber jabber, nigga right here in the streets. I ain't got no big ass bodyguards around me protecting me. I'm standing out here in the field, bro. Anybody that feel I'm doing something wrong, feel me? Come handle me appropriately. Whatever, whatever. I'm with all festivities, whatever, you know. You know, bro ain't here no more. I, I really don't give a fuck no more, really, though. So, I really, and I damn sure don't give a fuck how a nigga feel about me. Any nigga. Niggas been hating me all my life. You think I, think I give two fucks about a nigga hating on me or disliking me? One thing is, you can dislike me, you can talk about me all you want. And I don't mind that. One thing you're going to do, you're going to respect me, though. So, I ain't tripping. As long, as long as I got my respect, you can say what you want. Everybody entitled to their opinion. You feel me? But one thing is, you gonna respect me. Niggas don't like me. I know you niggas don't like me. Niggas don't like me, nigga. But you respect my violence. You respect I'm gonna get to, I'm gonna go to that level, whatever. I'm gonna give you that fair way. Anybody, anybody gets that. Anybody got action at that. So, I'm old school. I still play by the rules, so. Motherfuckers say what they want to say, text, tweet, whatever, it's all good. I'm out in the field, I'm doing something wrong, pull up, address the issue. Other than that, it's just, it just a lot of, a lot of jibber job, a bunch of talk, bro. I ain't trying to really hear it. Feel me, I got too much on my mind, bro. Feel me? What's up, bro, bro? Yeah. One thing I know, Nip was my homeboy, though. I know I'm gonna rob my marathon for my home. I know, I know one nigga that loves me. If never one of you niggas around here love me, I don't give no fucks, nigga. I know one nigga that had love for me, nigga. Nigga, and I don't give a fuck if never one of you niggas love me on. Six oak crip, I don't give no fucks. Nigga, I know one nigga that love me, nigga. One nigga. I know one. I know one nigga that had love for me, nigga. So regardless, nigga, I don't care what Nair nigga got to say, nigga. None of you niggas got to like me. I don't give no fucks. All right, champ. But you're going to respect me. Simple as that. You're not going to disrespect me. If I'm doing something wrong, come handle me accordingly. Let me know I'm doing something wrong. Bring it to my attention. 
give me the option to stop doing what I'm doing. So if I'm doing something wrong or 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 if not, if you, you accuse me, I'm gonna blatantly disrespect niggas then. I, you know, so easy call. So you know, this to whom it may concern, anybody that feel wanna know how a cowboy feeling, that's how I'm feeling. Really don't care about your opinion. You know, you don't, niggas don't see what I do every day. You don't see the people I help, and it ain't for you to see. It ain't for the show. You feel me? I grind, do what I do for me and what I got to do. You feel me? You ain't got to see the people I help. It's none of your damn business. You feel me? Yours. What's up, my guy? Where you from? Carolina. Carolina. Much love. Much love. Shout out to my little. I'm on my little live right now. Tap in. How you doing? Uh, you can't show your respect, buddy. Much love, bro, bro. And, just, and just so you know, ain't no, ain't none of this shit out here is a real marathon merchandise. You know what I mean? A lot of people sell a memorabilia and stuff like that. So don't get it twisted. The niggas on the grind. We not, we not knocking their hustle. You know what I mean? Uh, they can grind, sell memorabilia, do what they do, you know what I mean? But now if you bootlegging Crenshaw stuff, you actually taking their actual, and you bootlegging it, no, that's that's a violation. You feel me? But you going downtown, picking up shirts, and you flipping them, hey, I think that's cool as far as I'm concerned, you know what I mean? So support the ones, but if they got the blatantly bullshit-ass, boo-boo-ass Shaw shit on there, don't support that type of shit. You feel me? If you want real authentic shit, go to marathon.com, go to Nipsey's website, and get that type of shit. If you want to support the homies and shit like that that's doing their grind, do your thing. You feel me? It's all good. You feel me? Just, just know the difference. You just, just supporting the homies right here, and, and the website is supporting Nip and his family. You know what I mean? So, so either way, go to support as much stuff, bro. bro. Be better to just talk to you, let you know what's going on. So niggas know we really out here in the field. We really functioning with the crowd. We really, I love it when the fans come and I get a chance to tell y'all a Nipsey story or something. You know what I mean? The smile y'all give me y'all face. I see you on the TV. Yeah. I'm keeping it I see you on the TV. Yes, sir. During the years ago, I rode down the street and they, Still out here, man. You know what I mean? Running my lap. You know what I mean? I came out here before. Last time I came out here, I came out here with nighttime. I took a video on the other side. Yes, sir. But this is my first time being over here during the daytime. Man. Dude, I can see everybody coming to date. Yeah, be careful though, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, get in and out. Be careful. I'm in and out. You know what? Uh, 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 at the beginning, the police, uh, the city shut it down, they said, because we were blocking the alley. They shut it down because the vendors were in the alley. So they said the alley, we, we were blocking the alley to the tourists. So what they did was block the alley. So that was their solution. They said we were blocking it. So what they did, they blocked it. But uh, they cut a big ass hole in it, so people been going I'm back and forth. I'm just trying to go right with that. Oh yeah, but it, it ain't just like that, you know. You know, you, you you can very well do that, but it ain't, you know. Go do what you gotta do, but it ain't that type of ball game. You really, you know, you it's, it's a rough neighborhood. You can't be, you know, you gotta ask and show your respect. Probably don't write on the walls, none of that stuff. Take your trash, bring your trash. Don't leave no trash back there and shit like that. It's all good. You show your respect. Some people think leaving their name on the wall is showing respect. No. We don't do that. They roll all on Fat's face. They roll all on Nip's face. Come on. That's negative. We don't get out like that. You know what I'm saying? But y'all more than welcome. Take y'all fifth photo, especially while I'm here. Get in, get out. Do what you got to do. Uh, hey, you made this far. You better come to Cali and learn how to help a gay girl. You too good. You too good. Look at the girl. You ain't too good. Help a gay. What the hell? Look at that. Help a gay. Help fences. Come to the Crenshaw District and learn to help a fence. <laughs> Oh, oh, professor. Uh oh, there she go. So goes on in the crush shop yesterday. So goes on. Yeah, they said it was, it was too many tourists was popping up and, you know, uh, the alley was being blocked. So then why would you block the alley? So they blocked it. But, you know, uh, 
dude. It just, it used to be so much life around here when the shop was open and all that shit. It was, it was, it was, it was life around here. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now this is like, damn, this is like, look at this shit. It. I don't watch, I ain't even on watch old videos. Yeah, man. this shit was live. Bro, pull up, nigga, the music playing, shit was cool. Nigga, this shit like, nigga, like, this is like how it was when we first started here. When we first, in Open the 90s, up. when this shit was abandoned. When we first started, it was abandoned and raggedy and tore up. Now yeah, look at this shit, man. Story, man. This shit's depressing to go so far. To look, look at this shit now, bro. You know what I mean? Only thing keep it exciting is that the fans come through and show their respect and shit like that from around the world. But this shit is depressing. The gate, niggas lean on the gate, tow the gate up. Nigga, I done painted that probably like five, six times. So. No, it was the red part? Yeah, the, no, the white part. The niggas signed their names on the maritime part. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So at least when they gated it off and preserved it though. I wasn't mad at them for gating it. You spray painted it? No, no, my boy painted it though. Well, you, you yeah, got yeah. Them at the nymph pass, it was a gang, the niggas that wrote a gang of bullshit on the wall. You know what I mean? They had, yeah. caught, they had whacked out all kind of hoods, and all the hoods was waiting to come over and show their respect. You know, a Mexican dude, Danny, he jumped, he came over here and asked, could he paint something? I'm like, come on. So listen to the music. Listen to the music, bro. Tell you some shit. Shit, we been 